What's going on guys? Welcome back to the episode of Factory Outlet Simulator. Last episode we made a ton of progress, got made a ton of money, leveled up some, got um, some, that's right, our, our first employees hired. That was the, that was the big thing that we did. And um, there's actually been an update to the game since our last episode as well. We have, I don't know, I know the devs watched um, our prologue playthrough of this, or a couple episodes that we did on this, so maybe they, I don't know if they watched maybe my video on, the last video on that when I was talking about that, but what we could really use is, oh what it, So yeah, now we actually have the ability to just, like we talked about in the last episode, just select the number of items that we want to produce, and then they're going to go around, and they're going to actually get all of our machine... Oops, I did not mean to do that. They're going to go around and actually get all of our machines and everything all set up, so... But if you guys are enjoying this, be sure to drop a like in the video, show it some love and support, and if you guys are new around you're checking this out, be sure to hit that subscribe button down below, so you guys don't miss out on any videos that we're doing here. But um, yeah, you guys can see we are back, we got the face cam and everything all back up and running. I am back home in my normal recording studio setup kind of thing. And, uh, but yeah, so I'm really excited for this. But if you, like I said, if you guys are, drop a like in the video and uh, leave me a comment down below. Let me know what, you, what we should do here with this. Let's go ahead and open up all the doors here too. I know we did say we were going to work on the store in the last episode here today, but I, don't, I wasn't exactly expecting this. So I really want to try this out here if we can. So let's see employees. So we got, oh, the, okay. It shows our current ones over here now. So that's a change too. There hasn't been many other changes to the game since then, but this is a big one with that, um, with this one. Yeah, automated, oh, a daily salary $1,000, though. That is expensive. Okay, we're going to go ahead and do it, though. That's going to be a big help for us. I mean, obviously, oh, here she is. Hello, how you doing? Can we, or was that, oh, that's just our computer, I think. But yeah, so that's going to cost us $1,000 a day for that. Let's see here what we got. So we have, how much are we going to make on this? I can't 20,000 we're going to make on this. So Pomo shirts, yellow shirts. So we need 51 of these, 51 boxes of these, 510 of them. So we need Pomo yellow shirts. So if we go into here now, we should be able to... Pomo yellow. So we need colored thread and colored fabric. And then what we can do is we can just go and say... Oops. So we need, yeah... So it's just, this is the number of boxes that we need. So we can't obviously do it quite yet because we don't have the sufficient materials quite yet. So let's go to shopping. We need 51 of these and 51 of these. So, oops. We can go ahead and order that. And now we can go back into here. And now, if we do this, we can go 51 of um, 51 colored thread, 51 colored fabric. Colored, is something not working right with it? Okay, I think something might not be working right with it, because we have... So yeah, we have the ability to make that. I don't know why that's... It's even showing up as green. Oh, there we go. Oh, can... Oh, you know what? It's... Oh, is it because of the maximum on machines? Maybe. Or maybe 50... Okay, maybe actually 50 is just the max that we can make on these. So, if we go ahead and click produce, she is going to start... That is amazing. That is well worth the thousand dollars. And then we're gonna have our we're gonna have our employees, our guys that handle all of the uh, machinery, work right there, just taking care of all the rest of it for us. That is absolutely amazing. Although they're just standing around, we got. Oh wait, no, they're just not done yet. That's why I was gonna say what. What I think we're going to do here, too, is we're going to actually hire uh, my old... Uh, nope, not that. We want employees. So... Yeah, we have the factory restockers. So we're going to hire... 
So there, that is all the factory restockers that we can get. Oh my. I think we're going to get a repairman right away too. Because then we don't need to worry about anything even really. I know we're spending a lot daily, so we need to make sure that we keep. But like, look at this. That is just absolutely amazing. I think we do need to produce one more set. But like, look at them all go. That is insane. Um, that is so cool. I love that. Look at that. It's already almost completed. So we just need to make one more of these then. Okay, we can't now because I guess all the machines are busy or we're doing... Oops. Are we doing them already? I don't, I don't know. I think that's a repair, repair person right there too. I am curious. I do want to ch check out the uh, the vans and the van here too, if we can on things. I know um, some of you guys are saying that the van isn't all that worth it, not great. I do want to check it out still, if we can. And again, I know we said we were going to work towards getting work towards getting the store set up here today, but I was not exactly expecting to have um, this this update for this. This is absolutely amazing. The only thing that we have to do manually pretty much now is just loading the truck and unloading it. Which, um, maybe we'll get something like that in the future too here? I don't know. But this is exactly what this game needed at this point. Because now we can just easily produce things for everything. We don't need to worry about doing anything as far as running around the machines constantly. Trying to, trying to get everything all suited and taken care of. Sir, could you not sit and hold the merchandise please? Could you not try to steal the merchandise? Oops. Okay, so maybe something's just a little bugged with that. And you guys could see there, it was actually, uh, it was red, but we were able to actually just click on it. I guess I didn't try clicking on it at all before. So maybe we can do 51 and do that, but I don't know. We'll figure that out. But we need to um, get, yeah, we need to get all of this uh, all taken care of here. I mean, we're level 17, so we can get some more stuff unlocked here. Again, I, I know we said we we're going to work on the store stuff here today. I think it's just going to all be wholesale stuff again here because this is just too much fun messing around with this and I just want to keep unlocking more stuff and just keep working towards everything because once we get more stuff unlocked we can obviously do better for the store than right away too and uh, all of that so let's just let's just keep on focusing on this here at least for another day today like I said I wasn't exactly expecting to get a big update like this but this is so so worth it to do this because now we don't have to do any of the craziness we don't have to fix the machines we got the we got the mechanic now we can just kind of keep on rolling with everything here today. So yeah, this is going to be the longest process. We'll be loading and unloading the truck. And uh, it's funny. I, like I said, I even mentioned this in the... Uh, I think it was the last episode we just talked about this. Like, if only we could have somebody that we could just tell them to make this amount of... X amount of item. And then it gets produced. And that's exactly what this, what this did. So that's what makes me wonder if, like, the devs watched, um, watched our last video and um, added in based off of that. I don't know. It's like I said, I know the devs, they did watch our, our prologue playthrough on this of the few episodes, so maybe they, they saw this and took took the, took the some advice on it, and I don't know. But I'm just beyond excited and happy to have that. I know we're obviously spending a lot of money now on employees, which, oh wow, look at that. We just, we just spent a couple thousand dollars there on that. So, yeah, we're definitely spending quite a bit on employees, and we don't even have all of them quite yet. But, that's alright. I mean, we're making like 20k on this, so if we get into a little bit of bind, it is what it is. We'll, we'll figure it out. But, um, yeah, that are, there is all the rest of this. Let's just get all of this loaded on up. The only problem is the days just fly by in this. Like, can we slow down the time at all? I know some... Oh, there we go. So we can turn on and off the theft. I let, I did leave it on. That still seems... Okay, that definitely does. I was going to say, I couldn't tell if that was actually affecting things or not, but I actually do want to turn that way down because we are spending so much money daily on them now. And it was just flying through before, and there's no reason to have it all the way up. Whoops. Meant to hop on the truck. But there we go. That should be... I mean, we've got, what, eight below, and then... Wait. Eight below and four on top means 12. So we're missing one here. 
Yeah, we're missing one here. I think it's a little bit bogged with that guy, like, holding, holding on to it. I'm really glad that we just noticed that. Because, yeah, I think, yeah, he's hanging on to this, so he's trying to steal our merchandise. <laughs> but, okay, we're just going to have to order another set of things. That's fine. Um, shopping. One and one. It's 12 bucks. That's fine. And then let's try and make one. Yeah, so it... Yeah, I don't know why that's a little bit bugged. I think, can we accept another wholesale order too? I think you guys are telling me that we can do that. Um, also, which that's the one that we have here currently. That's the only bad thing is now we're going to be... This stuff's not going to be resetting as often, I don't believe. But, that's alright. It is what it is. But yeah, so he's... He's trying to steal our merchandise, which I can't even grab it from him. So, that's alright though. It is what it is. Maybe he'll drop it down the next time. Some maybe I'll maybe I'll let them try to pick this up here and see what happens with all of this. Yeah, these just take a little bit, but yeah, again, now we've got a repair person. She's gonna be taking care of everything. Thank you, appreciate you. And then we like look at our little army here. It's just slowly growing, and that's not even everyone. Okay. Yeah, he's not even coming to grab it anyway. So let's just grab it and throw it in the truck. Can we? Oh, there we go. Okay. Yeah, I'm really glad that we just noticed that, because that would have been a little unfortunate if we just got all the way over there and um, realized that we were one short. But it's going to fetch us over 20000 now at this point, so we're going to have the ability to um, get some more stuff unlocked and just keep working towards even more stuff here. Yeah, I'm glad we just looked at that with the daytime cycle. I, I thought I remember seeing that we could have that we could adjust that. So I'm glad that I just remembered to, to look at that with how much we're spending on them now. And so, yeah, that's why I'm just trying to uh, keep unlocking stuff so we can keep getting more and more higher level like wholesale orders and everything. And then we can just keep working on all that. And then, yeah, there we go. Tw almost twenty-one thousand for that. We have almost twenty-two thousand now in our pocket. So that is awesome. Love to see that. Okay. I see we're getting a little bit of like a lighting bug. It's like a little flicker in the game. I know some, some other games that we play sometimes have that, and I don't know what is what is causing that. But alright. Let's see what we got going on here. Okay. There we go, it's back on in. Let's see if we can unlock you. We're almost, almost, I mean, we're halfway through to level 18, more than halfway through level 17 to level 18 already, so that is awesome. Let's see what we got. That's right, we did just purchase all the rest of the license, not all the rest of the licenses, but we got these at 6,200, these at 5k. Okay, so yeah, we got a bunch of new stuff in there. I'm guessing that, oh, we do have another one here. Okay, so like these, now we need 28, 28 boxes of these sneakers. And that's going to fetch us, I mean, almost 15k profit on these. So HN red sneakers, what do we need for these? I guess we could probably just, yeah, we could just do it right from here. We don't even need to actually do it from the machines. Um, HN shoes, we need red sneakers. So we need, I mean, we could just order a ton of stuff here too. And just not even have to really touch anything. So we need white thread, colored fabric, basic pattern paper, and rubber. Um, shopping. 28. I think it was, right? Basic pattern paper, I know that for sure. We got some, I think this stuff's new too. The cardboard, essence, and glass. I think that's new. Copper might be new. Um, what else did we... So white thread colored fabric, rubber. White thread colored fabric, I just want to make sure. White thread colored fabric, yep. And then we need rubber. Okay. I don't know why I just went off of that. Wait, did I just order 25 of those? Or did I order 28? See, this isn't like updating fully. So there's 28. Or did we just not even... Oh, you know what? I might not have actually ordered that stuff. 
Um, oh yeah, you know what? I, did, I don't think I ordered that stuff. Okay. So maybe that's just me. Maybe it's not actually bugged out. I think I just... I just screwed up with that. 28, 28, and 28. Yeah, I think I just screwed up with that. That's why it was so cheap, too. Um, alright. So HN, we need 28 of these. Okay, so yeah, we can produce them. Oh, I love that. That is so cool. Okay. Let's see. Wholesale. So yeah, we can do other ones, I guess, too. So that's actually not too bad. Um... I'm not going to because the fact that we're going we're gonna to be unlocking probably some another new level of stuff here. Very shortly after, but... That is actually pretty cool. But I guess... See, I just feel like our store has fallen so far behind now. <laughs> we have nothing going on with that. I, we just need to... We need to get into the swing of things with that now. Because now what we can do is we can easily... Get even more machines to be able to produce all of our wholesale order stuff. And then we get some machines to produce all stuff for the store. As well. So let's see... I just want to... Um, expands. I know the store stuff was actually, yeah, that was pretty cheap. So let's, let's expand some of this out real quick and just see where that actually goes. Ooh, look at that. Okay. It's not like a ton of space, but it definitely expanded out. We're not gonna, we're, we're not gonna do a ton of expansion here in this, um, in this episode. We're gonna kind of try to leave some stuff for, um, when we actually start getting into the store stuff. Probably, again, in the next episode with this, but let's just set some of this stuff out, because, because we'll, I mean, we, we have, like, stalkers now, we have, yeah, see, this guy's, <laughs> just in the running around with our material, with, with our inventory, we know that I, he actually has it, because we lost the one, not that's a big deal, again, it was, like, 10 bucks for material on that, so maybe, maybe by the time we, we reload the game, he will, um, he will have either lost it or placed it on the shelf here or something. Again, I really don't care if we lose it. It's not a not a big deal. But I just more want the want it out of his hands. So he's not running around with it in his hands like that. But anyways, yeah, I'm actually really glad that we hired the uh, other warehouse guys, though. The factory restockers or whatever they are, because that is a huge help for us to have that. Now at this point, we just need some more machines. We need some more expansion for the where or the for the factory. Which, yeah, 12,000 for the next one. Like, look at 50k for that. Which, honestly, I guess in the grand scheme of things, we just, we're making like 20k um, at some of these. So, it's not even that big a deal. Here we go. Let's just grab this right away. We got our maintenance person that she, yep. She's going to go ahead and take care of all that. Look at that. Just tightening in that one bolt that's missing. <laughs> that's loose. Okay. Anyways, there we go. There's 28. Did not mean to do that, but that's all right. Go ahead and head over to the ship. Yeah, I, I, I'm absolutely loving the automation and everything of this now. That is so cool. Like I said, we just need to get to the point now where, where we have kind of that same automation for the store for this. So we can get like security checkpoints, security guard, um, cashiers, stockers. So we pretty much are just going to be at the point of just maintaining and just... I guess, like, managing the store itself and, like, the wholesale orders and everything. The wholesale orders have just been fetching us so much money. So, it's, like, it's so hard to, um, want to go away from that. But, um, we need, yeah, we need, we need to get back into things. It's a whole part of the, a whole part of this game that we really haven't done very much of. Besides, like, the first episode of this we did. Maybe the first two. And, um, so, yeah. Let's just get all of this added to here. And then... Yeah, we just need to save up some money then for the next episode so we can ex keep expanding the store, get some more shelving, afford some more product and everything here too, and there's level 18 for us so we can unlock some more new stuff. Probably do one more wholesale order and um, see where we're at with things with there. But yeah, I think there's a few little bugs with that, but with the uh, new like automated thing, obviously it's showing like where you don't have the material and you actually do, and um, you saying like you can't actually produce them when you can. So it's just a uh, little little weird bug, but I'm sure that'll be I'm sure that'll get taken care of here real soon from the devs after this going live now.
But all right, um, what do we got going on here? Let's see my outlets, licenses. Let's get yet again, even more. See, this is where I want to have like racks and stuff for like all of this stuff if we can. There we go. So we got even more stuff unlocked. We still got 12K in our pockets. Um, let's see here. Wholesale. Yeah, see, like, look at this now. Like, this is going to fetch us 864. Is that, yeah, that is the most by a little bit. But we're definitely doing this one then. So under over gray. Let's do that. Um... Does it need to be? Okay, there we go. So we need white thread, plastic button, and cheap zippers. Um, shopping. Plastic button, we need 36 of. Uh, and then 36 of these. There we go, confirmed. See, it's like a go, I don't, yeah, we can produce it, so I don't understand why that goes to that when we're good to go with that. So, I don't, I don't know. I don't understand that, but that's all right. But yeah, let's take a look real quick. Shopping here, interior. So, like, see, we want to get some of these different racks and stuff. Um, also, that's right, we haven't even gotten into, like, phone cases, which I don't know where they are then, because I don't think they're even a part of... They just like, no, these are all shoes and stuff. So how do we, I don't even know how we produce those. Yeah, we got the panel van we want to get. I guess that's where some of this stuff comes into play, but I don't think we can even, I don't, well, let's take a look at one of the machines. Yeah, like, look at all the stuff that we have here. There's, I guess we're not going to probably be able to have shelving for each of these. Because that would be so much to try to keep up with. And that's still not even all of it. So yeah, I don't know. We will see. <laughs> it is so loud. Okay. Yeah, like I said, that is it was so worth it to hire the um, other other workers. Now, like I said, we just need someone to come be able to come with us in the truck to load and unload, and then we'll be pretty much fully automated at that point. I guess even like just like a delivery person that kind of eliminates most of our job of things then. I, I do like the delivery aspect of things, but that would be like the next thing would be to have like an actual like delivery driver kind of thing. Even, not even, I guess, needing to have someone, I guess, like loading up the truck. We could do that ourselves and then have a delivery driver or something that would like take care of it for us. Yeah, there's our daily, holy crap, our daily expense is a 4400. That is insane. Okay. Um, do we have bills? I can't remember. Actually, no. <laughs> I think we do, don't we? Yeah, invoices. Okay, we have, our invoices are empty. No, so that's good. Okay. Look at all of our army of people just running over with with all the crates in their hands. I love it. Okay. And this should be about it then for this one. Right away. But yeah, we're definitely, unless there's like another update to the game or something, we typically do like our videos on this like every few days or so. Unless there's another update to the game, we're definitely going to come back in the next one then and keep working on our store. Or I guess I should, shouldn't really say keep working on because we really haven't done very much of that. We're going to really start diving into the store itself and trying to get a good supply of things and everything. I don't know if we're going to be able to get shelving for each and every item. I would love to, but I don't know if that's going to happen. I just realized we're going to the plane, not... I'm so used to going to the ship. We don't do many plane orders. Yeah, okay. But yeah, so we, we're going to have to figure something out if there's any way that we can get, like, every item type. That would be awesome if we can, but I don't know if it's going to be possible for the store itself. We might just have to pick, like, a select few, like, maybe half the items or a quarter of them or something and just um, do it that way. Because I don't know if we're gonna if we're gonna really going to be able to... Um, do that and also one thing why don't I just pull up next to it why do I pull up to the front of it like this I could just pull up like this what is going on 
Uh-oh. Okay, may as well load up some stuff real quick while we're... Oh, no. Okay, I don't know why we pull up to, like, the front of it. We may as well just... Do this, and... Yeah, that is so much better. So much more efficient. Okay. I don't know where these crates are just coming from, just flying off the, from the side like that. Okay. Yeah, see, this is where, like, it starts to get a little tedious, especially this is only 36. Like, we have some that are over 50 for all of these. There we go. Look at that. Another over 22,000. I thought that was only like 14. Why do I feel like that was only like 14? It's supposed to be like 14. I don't know. Let's go take a look real quick and see what else. See, we got like, these little lighting like clickers. I don't know if it's just something on my computer. I know I talk about that a lot, that our computer is, that I use here is definitely not up to par. Well, game, gaming laptop that I have. Um, that's something we're, we're working towards here still. Getting a nice new um, powerful beast desktop built. But um, definitely something that's in the works still. I just realized I actually shouldn't be pulling into here like this because it bugs out and goes flying. <laughs> um, okay, look at that. So that's like a 25k profit, but that's 52 of those. Oof, okay. So yeah, it's a little bit a little bit pricey for that. Um so yeah, like I said, I think we're gonna come back. We're gonna come back in the next episode. We are going to get we'll start working on some of the store stuff here and um keep working on all that because we really again haven't done very much of that we've been closed for so long. And I do wanna try to keep both aspects of it running. And we do have like all of our, our stockers and stuff. Not licenses, but I guess yeah, we got everything. Excuse me. Yeah, we've got like our cashiers, store restockers, security. So just a bunch of store restockers and a security guard and then the um, cashier, which I thought that... I want to see. I swore... Oh, that's right. There's all these different signs and everything too. But um, yeah, so we got like the store storage rack too, which we're going to need. Oh, advan... Advan... Ah. Hmm. Okay. Yeah, we got like hats and stuff too, like headsets, bags, perfumes. Yeah, here's the security gate. This is what we need for our store itself too. And oh, a nice new register. What is that? Does that fetch us anything? Like, does that help us with anything? Or are we just spending money on that? <laughs> I don't know. But um, yeah, so that security thing is going to be an absolute must for us. I guess we probably could. Or is that the same one? I thought it looked a little fancier, but maybe not. Maybe it is a... Okay, actually, that does look to be about the same. I thought ours was a little crappier looking. But yeah, I think that is the same. It'd just be another register then. Okay, so we don't need to worry about that at all. Um, Got some mannequins. Yeah, we need some fitting rooms too. That's another thing that we're going to need for all of that. But that's all going to be in the next episode for this. But yeah, we're going to come back, like I said, work on some of that. Grab a nice thumbnail for the video for this. But yeah, that's going to do it for this one, guys. So if you guys enjoyed this, be sure to drop a like in the video. Show it some love and support. And if you guys are new around you're checking this out, be sure to hit that subscribe button down below so you guys don't miss out on any videos that we're doing here. But thank you all very much for watching. I hope you all enjoyed it. I will see you on the next one. Peace out, guys. Thank you.